In this video, we show you how to take a test in the Cellevision Proficiency software. Open an internet browser window and navigate to the Cellevision Proficiency software. Log into the software by entering your email or username, as well as password. Your account start page shows you a list of ongoing and completed tests. Tests you need to take are listed under Ongoing. At the moment, there is only one ongoing test that needs to be completed by the date shown next to it. You can see a variety of information about this test and the slides that you need to review and sign to complete the test. To open the first slide, click Open. By default, you are first shown the WBC tab. When starting the WBC classification, all cells are assigned to the unidentified class. To complete the WBC classification, you need to classify all the unidentified cells to their correct classes. To do so, click a cell and drag it to its correct class in the side panel. You can also classify by using the right-click menu. When working in the To Gallery view, you can also open the class you wish to move cells to in the right gallery using the drop-down menu in that gallery, or by right-clicking on the class in the side panel. Once the correct class is open, drag the cells directly into the gallery. You can classify multiple cells at once by selecting them using the Shift or Control keys. To take a closer look at a cell and maybe add a cell comment, double-click it. Use the mouse wheel to magnify it further. Any cell comments you enter will be visible to the examiner or supervisor later in the results view. In case there are multiple white blood cells shown in one image, you can turn on the cell marker to indicate which cell needs classifying. Continue until all white blood cells are classified. If the slide also contains a red blood cell image, you will see an RBC tab next to the WBC tab. Proceed to the RBC characterization by clicking the RBC tab. Zoom in on the RBC image using either the mouse wheel or the zoom slider. Move around the image by clicking and dragging it. Click anywhere on the RBC image to zoom into that area. Move the mouse around the RBC image to move the position of the magnified area. To get a feeling for the size of cells, drag the ruler. The ruler represents normal ranges for microcytosis and macrocytosis and automatically scales up or down according to the zoom level of the RBC image. After visually assessing the red blood cells in the image, grade the RBC morphology using the sliders in the side panel. 0 represents normal levels, and 3 indicates that the morphology is present at a high level. Now that you have classified all white blood cells and characterized the red blood cells, you are ready to sign the slide. Once you have signed a slide, you cannot make any more changes. Continue classifying and signing all slides in the test until all slides have a check mark. The test is now 100% complete. You can see that the test is now listed under Completed. Depending on the settings for the test, you may need to wait until everyone has completed the test to see your results. If the examiner allows it, you can see your results even if not everyone is finished. This is indicated by the Unlock icon. Thanks for watching! You can find more information about this topic by clicking the Help icon in the software.